Hey guys, welcome to my channel and in this video I'm going to tell you that why you should never subscribe to any Linux YouTuber because this is a disrespect, okay? So let me open my private window and just show you that how to get notified without subscribing to any Linux YouTuber without disrespecting them. So for example, let me go to Brody Robertson who is one of the best Linux YouTubers out there and let me just go to his channel. He made so many videos uh, regarding Linux. I just love that. Love this thing about him. Okay, so how do you know get notified with any of his new notification without subscribing him because he don't like it by the way uh, when he says subscribe to my channel he doesn't mean subscribe like click on the subscribe button he means using rss feed i just want to clear this on behalf of him okay so because he you know he hesitated he thought like everybody already know but i know you guys are no like you don't know okay even i got so many subscribers like who the who are these 15k people so let me just click on view source okay and let me search channel id so this video is not for those who understand what rss feed is and in case if you don't know what rss feed is well you don't have to worry about it i got you okay so if you use linux okay if you don't use linux then i don't know so just copy this thing so what what was this thing this is the channel id so you have to get the channel id for your favorite linux youtuber and then you just have to type youtube.com feeds videos dot xml question mark and then channel underscore id is equal to and paste the channel id of any of you know what any youtuber not just linux youtuber why just you know why restrict us so let me copy this link and now we are done with browser open our terminal and type curl and just paste this link and i can also give minus s for you know some silence it doesn't matter so if i press enter you can see we get the content of rss feed so rss is like an xml feed if you don't know what rss is this video is not about rss so let me just ignore it what you have to do is you just have to pipe this content whatever we got into grab and type video id press enter and right now what you're seeing is is the last 15 as you can see let me pipe it in wc minus l last 15 video ids of Brody robertson and this is what we want so let me remove the count uh, so now we just want the latest video to be honest so head minus n1 and we got the latest you know video id of Brody robertson now i don't want this 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 text here okay i just want id so what I can do here is I can pipe this in uh, cut command actually. There are plenty of ways to do it. Uh, let's just first use cut command. So we are going to cut this string from here. Okay, carefully, carefully. So delimiter is this and then field two, press enter. So we, we remove this section here, the entire thing before this. Now we have to cut this from here. So delimiter is this bracket here. So pipe this, cut, delimiter, this bracket f1 okay one and boom we got the id and this is what we want like if i just make a variable out of it and just type mpv youtube https youtube and shorten link of youtube and press enter so this is just going to play the latest video of Brody robertson do you know what time it is yeah it's four, four 55 and i really have to sleep right now okay so as you can see we we can we are able to play the latest video of Roddy robots this is so cool but i don't want to play uh actually i can download too but i don't want to do any of this i want to write a shell script so let me go into local bin and let me just type vim and then you know no t y t notify notify dot sh okay and type bin bin sh and type a while true loop so while true is like a forever loop and let's just sleep for 15 minutes for no reason actually there is a reason so after sleeping for 15 minutes or before sleeping uh 15 minutes what we are going to do is we are just going to do whatever we did here okay so let me just copy this entire line uh this entire line and paste it so not this line actually okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get latest variable from here. We need to paste the entire command. This is not the entire command. Grab and this is the entire command. All right. Grab and this is the entire command. I think grab spelling is wrong. So let me just paste it. 
Right. All right. This is it. So latest variable now will now contain the ID, the latest ID. Okay. And now after this, I'm going to make copy of latest. So copy or L copy or prev. Let's call it prev and latest. Okay. So prev is now the copy of latest. Okay. Prev is now the copy of latest. So before latest or I, I guess after latest. Yeah. After latest. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to compare if, okay, how to compare in shell. So just these bracket, if, okay, I always forget this thing. Latest is equal to brave. Brave is like a previous string. So what we are trying to do. So we are trying to check um, if we are getting a new variable in our latest variable okay so if the value is changing okay so if this happened then done or why done then uh if i notify saying watch so watch what watch brody's latest video so latest so latest is like the id that's it okay so in notify saying you can give a header and then so we are just trying to get notification. I can just close this thing here. Notify saying Brody upload. Okay. And then, you know, URL. That's it. So what we did right now, prev is equal to latest and latest is equal to, um, if it's actually, it's not equal to, if it's not equal to, that's, that's the correct thing, right? If it's equals to, then we, we have to ignore. If it's not equals to, then we have to, notify okay so i don't know how to test this but you got the idea right and there's one more thing i want to tell you that uh, in this command instead of using two cuts what we can do is uh, let me just show you so here if i press enter so we, we are getting what we want but these two cuts are looking ugly so instead of this we can use said so if i press enter here so what i can do is i can use said to remove these uh, you know brackets so i have this command in history so said and then you know bracket press enter okay so it's it's an error because i forgot this thing here press enter and here we are getting some you know white space so i can just pipe it into tr so i thought like the theme is almost like a same length command like there is nothing we are changing so yeah so this is how, like, this is the second way we can get the ID. So use your creativity about this script. I'm actually confused whether it's a correct way to, you know, not equal to or not. So yeah, so this is a script and what this script will do is it will send you a notification, something like this. Uh, so I'm not sure. Um, wait a second. What, 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 where is that command? Okay. So this command is giving us a YouTube ID. Let me just make a variable of it like a uh, wid id is equal to oh sorry about that make a variable and after this notify send and instead of latest wid id so we will get a you know, notification like this so that's the video this is how you can you know just get the notification for your favorite linux youtuber or you can just make a list in local bin and then loop over from that list like something like this while read line uh and then you know in dot local share uh subs or channels channels dot txt channels dot txt and then you know just loop over each line or something like that so that's the video thanks for watching and don't subscribe to any linux youtuber okay all right Press the red button and subscribe me, please. Okay, bye.